Ah, boy. The first week of school in Jamaica was like none we have ever seen before. It had social media littered with colorful expression and words taken from modern language class. As if that was not enough, the artists were also called upon to draw Miss Beer as you dare. We like you were surprised and it kicked us on the street to get the people's views and suggestions. Listen. <laughs> Shut your mouth. You can't eat like you're a damn idiot. You know, see online class this. Last week was the first week of school for online classes. What has your experience been like? Well, my dad got the Bridgeport School. Well, experience was all right, cause it's new and you're going to have glitch. Right now, we wish the them could have dead in a school, but they can't be here. So now, we just have to second for where we get and everybody has got to have problem. And the problem is there, so we just have to work with the system. And the teacher them, we listen to them from other schools and other places talking, and them doing them job, them trying, at least. Uh, the material them picking the kids, some of that don't come through. So we just hope this corona uh, virus disappear and people go back to school as normal. But for now, everything is on track, as best as the government can do it. And I'm not a fan of the government, but at the same time, they might do them thing. And they're trying their best, not the one party and it, but they're trying their best, everybody. And the teachers, they might try, put them on time. They now not get enough money. Teacher to get money, they now get enough money, but they try. What do you think about the videos going around on social media about online classes? Well, some of them is good. Come here, some positive, a lot of negatives, and some of them are good the people, the uh, parent walking the class, walk in front of the camera naked. It don't happen because it's just human and accidents are the app. So I just, you know. Do you think we should have had these publications? Which publication? These videos that came out, do you think that they should have been yes. published? Yeah, you can't just hide everything. You can't hide things, you know. Publish where publish make people who mature and have sense read out the nonsense and can formulate and say, okay, this was an accident that happened and this wasn't and whatever, but you know, I don't. What would you change for this week? What would I change? Well, my daughter personally, I wish the teacher would give her more reading online. To give out, then get the maths and the social study, but me more need to lead to the reading side. Were you able to be a part of your daughter's class last week? Not verbally, but I was in the background and you know. What was it like? Was it a uh, chalkboard talking? What was it like? It was more. It was more conversation. It was more conversation and then sending the uh, the work and she did the work and you know. But everything was okay. So, if you were supposed to grade it, what would have been the grade for last week? For last week, it, everything was new. So, I did them a... I won't say I see, I see too low. I did them a B, but just brilliancy, trying to do something. Last week was the first week of online classes. What has your experience been like? Okay, my experience, I don't really have a bad experience because my son, they are very big and they sit down and pay attention and do their work. But what I don't understand, you would see some people, some kids doing their work and then you see naked person pass. That is not right. Some kids um saying that they don't understand. Some kids again saying um, they prefer face-to-face um, -face class because then they will see their friend and they will understand better. But for me, I don't have a problem with it. What would be your advice to the authority for the naked persons passing by? Um, I think that person should have sense and knowing that class is going on. Or maybe that's what you do all the while so she don't you know, mind. I don't know. Question. What do you think about the videos going around on social media about online classes? What with which of them? Because there's a lot. Those that they consider to be funny with the kids and the parents and some things that seems to be child abuse. It's not. There's nothing funny about that. I think we should shape up and know what is going on because the, the virus is going around. And if um you have face to face classes, a lot of people more would get sick. Understand? So the government doing what they can to help us, the parents and the children. So I think we should have an understanding and work with the government. Last week was the first week of school with online classes. What has your experience been like for the first week? 
Well, for the first week, uh, some children don't get on to it as they should get on to it. And some children look frustrated. So I think they need some more practice. There were some funny videos going around, person would have said. What do you think about these funny videos? I did not see it, but if there are funny videos, it should not be up. It shouldn't be out. Do you no. think it's wrong or right? It's wrong. What advice would you give to the authority for the new school week? Um, to tell them um, to get connected and, and try to grasp as much as they can grasp. What was the real problem with connection last week? Well, sometimes the, uh, the phone was out. You can hear the children. Last week was the first week of school for online classes. What has your experience been like? It was rough, but I had difficulty logging in on some of the classes. What platform were you using? Zoom, Google Classroom? I was using Zoom and Google Classroom. And my school, Jamaica. And? My school, Jamaica. My school, Jamaica. That's a Jamaican platform? Yes. Wonderful. Now, what do you think about the videos that were going around on social media about online classes? Well, I don't know because people really have been difficulties while some people don't understand what is going on or how to log in or how to set up the internet and stuff. What advice would you give to those parents uh, that you would have seen on social media with the online classes and what seems to be child abuse? Um, just um, be careful what you're doing and make sure your environment is clean and when you're online, you do the best you can. What advice would you give to the authorities for online school this week? Um, to, to try to do a better thing that we can get a better login and login better to the internet. So is it an internet problem or is it a school problem? I think it's mostly an internet problem and a school problem because if you can't get through with the internet and the login stuff is difficult with both, both the teachers and parents. You are watching I Think I Have the Answer. We publish every Monday. Please ensure that you like, share, subscribe. We are online and we might be in your community soon. Last week was the first week of school. What has your experience been like? Well, my experience so far is good. The teachers are on top of the game so far, so I have no complaints. Mm -hmm. There were some videos going around last week about online classes. What's your view on that? Oh, my views. Some people find it funny, but I don't. The parents, they need to, be, to do better. You understand? You can't call in a child an idiot. Because if you call your child an idiot, what to leave other people out there to call your child? If you put down your child, other people put down your child, you can't complain. You understand? You cannot use illiteracy. You understand? You have to be patient. Not, don't tell the child a bad word. Calling the child an idiot and all of that. You understand? You have to sit down and take the time and not leave everything to teacher. This is why we have so much kids. No love. You understand? You don't show your child any love. You can call a child an idiot. Show your child love and sit down and help the child. Help the child. What would you suggest to the authorities read this online video for the kids and teachers? Okay, let me tell you this now. I feel like the teachers, I understand, should have a, a board. So, and they teach off the board, like school, teach the children they would understand better than just talking and they have to write. Because remember, you know, not every child still can, can, can spell, you know. So I feel like they should have this board. And the teachers go to school and set up the camera and teach off the blackboard. Because sometimes it confuses the kids them a lot. Have you seen any online classes for yourself? Yes, my daughter. Yes, it was mostly talking. It was the first week of school for online classes. What has your experience been like? Oh, it's awful. Awful? No, would, would not an easy experience. What was it like? And some students don't have enough. Um, some students don't have um, enough in, no internet. Like the, rural, the, um, the rural areas didn't have any internet, so they were not able to connect? No, the most of them not able Were you able to have a look at the videos that were passed around, re-social media, re-online classes this year? Some of them. Some of them? You saw these videos? Yeah. What's your view? Teacher, have a hard time. Very hard time. 
a very hard time. What advice would you give to the authorities? Um, they need more um, internet more, um, device so you can able to do it online. Do you think this week will be better than last week? Re online classes? I hope so. Last week was the first week of online classes for the new school year. What has your experience been like? Well, um, well, um, the online classes it makes sense. It makes sense in our way because you have some people come and prepare for it. Then from from about August, I think they might say so October, October the fifth. Online class, you have some people prepare for it, and while some not prepare for it. Do you think that it will work? It will work for yeah, it will work. It will work for some, but not work for all. Cause I can see the hear the voice note and the and the, the, the video and something them over on social media and the album. What's your view on those voice notes and those videos with those kids and parents and teachers? Well, do you think it was right? Should we have more of those this week? You can't be right, you know, because the voice not a beer and um, indecent language, so that couldn't be right, you know. Are you seeing any sign of child abuse in these videos? Well, yeah, verbal abuse, um, beer, um, disrespectful and all these things. Do you think that the government should take action? What type of action the government can take up, um, pretend to, um, voice note and something like that? The views were many, the scenes frightening. We suggest that this week we be more understanding of our children's fear and their burning desire to be the guinea pig of change. Until next week, be patient with the change. I am Ricardos from I Think I Have the Answer. Tell us in the comment section below, do you want to see more online class videos this week?